right, how's it coming? It's coming nice. <laughs> it couldn't come any better. <laughs> You're ridiculous. <laughs> how's the project coming? It's going good. So, Just gotta get some railing tops on there and kind of tie this into this post to add some stability and decorative appeal and and the railing will be done. So for the railing, are you gonna cut these at an angle or the railing will be cut? I think I'll cut the railing at an angle. Like so it'll in meet. here. And I don't know if I'll cut these off the same angle with it or leave them flat and put something on top of them. Some sort of decorative cap or something. Yeah. And I let the top posts is offset by, I don't know, about an inch from the bottom post. So there's going to be a little bit of an angle to it, which was not necessarily intentional, but I think it'll look kind of cool if I cut the angles right on the railing to fit that. Well, I will be excited to see the finished product since I can't totally imagine what you're talking about, but that's often the case. And then it turns out amazing. And I might just cut, cut the angles on that to do the top. Okay. So because I put the steps on first and I'm putting the rail posts on after the fact, I needed to kind of custom fit the posts so that they notch into everything and I didn't want to take the stairs back off. So I just kind of notched the post here so it'll slide on and maybe give it a little bit of a custom fit here and um, make it look like it fits pretty tight. Nice. some screws in from the outside. I think that'll be pretty good. All right. So this is today's project is getting the railing on our new stairs. And Ryan went in and if you saw the video from the other day, our reel, there was still an opening all along here. So he got enough boards to go back and put facings on each step. So now there's no opening and it just looks like a solid staircase. It is stair stringers. How many did we use? Five. Five stair stringers across this, attached to this header board. And then we put two, two Trex deck pieces for, uh, per stair. And then that one to finish off. So then we'll have railing and paint it to match the trim. And we'll have this beautiful entrance to the new house. So I have been in training class and I came out and uh, the railings are done. I am constantly amazed by my husband's ability to bring his project to life. And even if he has to change a little bit, I don't think this is exactly the design that he had planned at the beginning, but it looks great. So I will give you a little bit of a close up of it. What do you think, Cookie? Does it look amazing? this grand staircase to walk up and down like the princess that you are. Oh yes, going to up dog for us. So of course the wind picked up right when I started. Um, but yeah, we showed you earlier, Ryan did the first, the fronts, the facings of each stair. So now we have a complete staircase. And then he also built these railings because we know we want to make sure that people are safe coming up and down. Uh, I actually got a little close to the edge the other day. I also fell off the first steps. So yeah, apparently I'm going to be the one who needs them the most. But I love what he did up top. He wanted to, we had to work with the edge of the stairs here. And so he created this little piece that spans the gap between the columns and the railing because it didn't quite meet. This was a very interesting opening. It's nine foot opening and most boards come eight feet or you have to get larger ones and cut them down. So we used eight foot boards and that meant that we had about a six inch span. So just like he showed where he notched out these columns, then that is connected to the 
house column by this piece right here and then we'll figure out what kind of railing we're going to use kind of as spindles we used rope over on the tiny house and might do something like that but I don't know with the aesthetic and the rebar that's here we might figure out something that looks a little bit more like that maybe cable or just other wood so I'm excited by the finished product it all looks so good and sure beats the rickety staircase that they gave us um, at the dealership which was nice at least we had a way to get to the house but I'm so impressed by this big grand entrance and then the other staircase is now at the back door. Talk about small town Saturday night. This is what ours consists of now. <laughs> Enjoying the rain <laughs> and watching the hummingbirds fight over the hummingbird feeder. <laughs> Undisturbed. Oh. The way oh, they're gonna team up. Ooh. Oh, they hit him. <laughs> Knocked him to the ground, I think. <laughs> 